Hi, this is Law of Attraction with Candice. If you miss me, please subscribe to my channel and please hit that bell notification ding so you can get notified whenever I post a new video. And please hit that thumbs up button so I know you're enjoying my videos. I'll leave a comment down below or both. And please follow me on Facebook, Law of Attraction with Candice, and Instagram at L O A with Kit the end. And before you manifest that shit, don't forget to let, let it, go. it go. Let it go. Let it go. This is my new intro. Enjoy my video. Here we go. Hi, I'm back. Did you miss me? <laughs> I said I'm going to post a video today. I want to post this video today because tomorrow's my birthday. And I believe that I deserve to get what I want and I deserve for all my wishes to come true. So that's what this video is about. Knowing that you deserve to get what you want. You could start by using this affirmation. I deserve to get what I want. I deserve to get what I want. I deserve to get what I want. You could also listen to my be happy and confident video so you can feel confident and happy with yourself so you know you could deserve what you want. You could deserve what you want for many different things. You have to really feel that you really deserve to get what you want. Some people might be negative, not love themselves enough, and not think they deserve to get what they want. You have to really believe that you deserve it. Think of all the good things that you have done in your life. Think of the good person that you are. If you're a good person and you've done so much good for people, you deserve to get what you want and have a good life. Even with love, you deserve to have a good partner. Don't stick with people that are bad for you. It could be with friends also. You deserve the best and you need to believe that you deserve it. So keep saying that affirmation or write affirmations down or you do the 369 or the 33 by 3 and write, I deserve to get what I want or I deserve this thing. So do those techniques and write it so you know that you deserve to get what you want. I'm going to read some parts of my book about talking about deserving to get what you want or deserving a better love or friendship. So let's join in here. You should not obsess over someone who does not want to be in your life. You will find the one and you can have more friends. You should not want someone who does not want to be in your life. Know your worth and know your standards. If you do not show any standards, then people will walk all over you. If you do not believe your worth or you deserve or know that you deserve better, then you will not get better. A part of loving yourself is knowing your worth and having standards. Remember, if you do not love yourself, then other people will not love you and you will not get what you want because then you are not content with yourself and you are not attracting yourself to good things. People will be attracted to you if you love yourself. Also, know that you deserve better. When you believe that you deserve better, then you will get better. Candace now has a small circle of friends who she can trust, who she has a lot, who she has a lot in common with, who she, who she enjoys being with, and who are understanding. Candace is no longer friends with someone who did not fully have those things. Over time, Candace did not really enjoy hanging out with her anyway. <laughs> Anymore, sorry. The universe must have hurt Candace, again, because she is no longer friends with that person, with this person. She knows that she deserves better, even with Dan. She did not let, she did not let him keep seeing her because she had standards. And she knew that she deserved the commitment. When she, he saw that, it attracted him more to her. Candace would also tell people yes all of the time. She would do things for people all of the time. Candace's male best friend has taught her how to tell people no. And if they understand, then they are worth keeping around. If not, like this former friend did not, they are not worth keeping around. Candace is me. <laughs> so if you don't know, I have this book called How I Manifested My Soulmate and More. So this chapter is called How I Grew as a Person. So I learned to believe that I deserve better. And that's when I just started not caring about losing friends and when, how I got my boyfriend because I knew I deserved to be committed to and he wouldn't do that first. And now we are, of course, as you should know if you are 
are subscribed to me mm -hmm. and watching my videos. <laughs> Anything else? About deserving. So I'm going to read the second to last paragraph of this book. And there are a lot of my tips in here that I have talked about in my videos. <clears throat> Go back and watch my videos so you know all my tips to manifesting. This concludes this book. I hope everyone learns from Candace's journey and they follow her rules so they can manifest what they want. Remember to love yourself, be positive, let it go, but also try to get what you want. Be content and happy. Be patient. Have faith, believe, ignore in negativity, know your worth, know that you deserve you want what you want, but it may not be good for you like a person that has left you. Have standards. Do not care what people think about you. Do not complain or nag. Do not obsess. Do not worry. Pay attention to the signs like angel numbers and think about or list everything that has happened to you for a reason. These rules will help you manifest the things that you want. So that is like the conclusion to my book. So know that you deserve to get what you want. Know that whatever God or the universe has taken away from you, they don't deserve you. You have to believe that you deserve to get what you want. Picture it, visualize it, know it, believe it, write it. Say it, and you will get the things that you want. And if anyone wants to leave your life, bye. They don't deserve it. And that concludes this video. Thank you. I will post shorts tomorrow like I always do, especially for my birthday. I took off tomorrow because I deserve a break. Even though I just had a four-day weekend for Thanksgiving, now I'm having a three-day weekend. I don't want to work. <laughs> I want to be a YouTuber, so subscribe to me so I can have millions and millions of YouTube subscribers and I can make money that way. <laughs> Remember, I'm here to help you, okay? I want you to manifest what you want. And this is why I deserve to get what I want because I'm such a good person. I'm here to help you. I really am. Thank you. And don't forget to subscribe. See you tomorrow in my shorts. Oh, you know what I realized? I could do a 60 second short. I thought they were all 15 seconds. So I decided to Google why they're only 15 seconds. All you have to do is hit the 15 second circle and it turns to 60 seconds. If you didn't know that, now you do. Because <laughs> I'm like, the shorts are so fast and a lot of them I have to talk fast and rush. Sorry if I talk fast in some of my videos and my shorts. So shorts is the reason. I'm just a fast talker. Plus, I don't want to make these videos long and boring. I need to get to the point. But I end up ram rambling on all the time like I am now. So I'll I shut up. see you next week. Like in the video. But tomorrow and the next day, next day, next day in shorts. Bye. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to me. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And please don't forget to hit that bell notification ding. So you can get notified whenever I post a new video. Because they are random. And please give the video a thumbs up so I know you're enjoying the video. And please follow me on Facebook. Love Attraction.